Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Lexi and it is wash day. So I figured I'd just put the camera on and wash my hair with y'all like I did last time. It's fun. No new products to try today? Comment down below and let me know some new products that you want me to try out. I haven't had anything that I really want to bring to y'all. But today we're doing project empties because I'm trying to empty stuff. Y'all know if you're not new here, I love a good empty. I love emptying, getting through products. So I walked to my product shelf and I was like, what have I not used in a while and what needs to be used? <laughs> because you know products do expire. Okay, if you didn't know, you should know that though for real. I came up with this lineup and I'm hype. They all work pretty well for me. I don't have anything negative to say about them. So we're gonna start off with the My Black Is Beautiful Clarifying Shampoo and the Restorative Mask to wash and condition our hair. And then we're gonna go in with the Pattern Beauty Scalp Serum for the scalp. <laughs> and the last thing we're gonna use is the Ajua Beauty Biomint Leave-In Conditioning Styler. Very simple wash day, shouldn't take more than an hour. Let's hop into the shower before I talk for 10 more minutes. shower my hair feels amazing soft and lush the key really because when you apply a conditioner sometimes it's just like whatever but when you take a shower and let the hot water push <laughs> the conditioner into the strands I was rinsing my hair like wow I remember I really did love this conditioner so my hair is soaking wet and I'm gonna go in with the Ajo Beauty Biomint leave-in conditioning styler I'm just gonna put four and a half. <laughs> I think I counted that right. I think. Four and a half pumps all throughout my hair. I really love the smell of mint. Eucalyptus, rosemary, all of them. All of them. <laughs> all of them put me in a good mood. People often ask me about tangling, and in reality, like, I'm just continually pulling my hair out pulling it down i'm not squishing it up upon itself because you don't want tangles so 
So I'm basically just lengthening it, wanting the product through it, stuff like that. And that really helps to keep the tangles down, at least for my hair. So I'm gonna section her off and put the plaits in. I'll apply more product for each plait, just a little bit, not too much. Normally I would put on my For My Kinks towel. It's right here. My For My Kinks microfiber towel. It's available in my shop. I will leave it down below. It's always down below. <laughs> but I'm in a rush. I wanna braid my hair and truthfully get in the bed, it's nighttime. So we're just gonna like detangle, braid, and get in the bed. We're not even gonna let it air dry a little bit. A good conditioner should really leave your hair feeling soft. It should leave your hair feeling smooth. You should be able to do what I'm doing now, like really pulling the hair apart, sectioning it off. It should feel soft. If your hair still feels really tangled after conditioning, you might should look into a different conditioner. And then I just put this into like a little knot. Also, I'm pulling the ends out. These movements also stretch the hair because when it comes time for me to take down the section and to begin braiding it, it's already been stretched a bit. It's already been pulled out all the little dead hair and the little breakage that's left over from the shower. Cause in the shower, I'm also pulling out <laughs> dead hair and breakage. All right, y'all, that's the whole wash day. I put in eight plots. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.